Hi everyone, this is Diane Mills and I am the author of Airborne. You know, one of the crazy and amazing things that happened when I got the idea for Airborne, and by the way, it was long before COVID, and the idea was, what if a virus is unleashed on board an international flight? And so it actually cooked for a couple of years. And I had no idea what I was going to do with this story because I didn't know who to talk to. So uh, I was in Albuquerque, New Mexico, and understand, I live in Houston. And I was talking to a lady who was a presenter at the conference I was teaching at. And she was introduced to me as a doctor of microbiology and immunology. Well, we got to chatting and she said to me, you know what, Diane, I've always wondered what it'd be like to read a novel in which a virus is unleashed in a crowd. Because I've seen so many movies and read so many books that they really got it all wrong. So if you ever want to do that type of novel, let me know and I'll help you. Well, that got me excited. So I came home and I started to make notes and she and I text back and forth and I realized that the airline I wanted to use, I didn't know what the protocol was all about. I didn't know about medical emergencies and what they would do. And my husband happened to say, hey, there's this guy at church. I think he trains flight attendants. So I contacted him, and wouldn't you know that he trains the flight attendants for the type of airlines that I was looking for. So we talked, and he gave me all kinds of wonderful information. So I continued to take notes, and I'm thinking, maybe I could write this story. In the process of everything, I contacted the CDC. And they are amazing. They gave me so much information. And they were excited to talk about what they do when deadly viruses and diseases uh, break out. And that was wonderful again. So I'm starting to write this novel and I still feel unsure. And uh, I talked to a gentleman who lives not far from me. He joined my writer's group. And my husband said to him, hey, what is your day job? He says, I'm a pilot. And it was for the same airlines that I wanted to be the focal point of my story. So with all of that together, I was able to put together Airborne with a whole lot of authenticity. And I just wanted to share that with you because that doesn't always happen when we're writing stories, but it helped make Airborne realistic. Thank you.